son is Cheryl. This is Chloe. Hey. Chloe just turned 13, so she's kind of the same age that Ethan would be. Well, I think a year older than Ethan. And I think what I'll do for you is just go ahead and teach a normal tap class that I would give to an intermediate um, 12 to 13 year old age group. So we're going to start with a warm up and center. You ready? Okay. We're going to go, I'm going to show you the combination first and then I want to see if you can pick up the pattern. Did your first turn here, 
And I teach my tap turns to open to the side as they go, so really it's more this way. Okay, and the reason I do that is because I think you get started turning better, so therefore you can do either more revolutions or revolutions or more feet in one turn. Okay. If you start here, you haven't accomplished anything for your turn. So now you have to do the whole thing in that one little foot thing. Okay, okay? so let's try it that way. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight. Go back, I'll change. 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 Good. All right, now, if you cannot hold the last rock position, what do you think you're doing wrong? If you go rock, not holding your core, or maybe not as deep a plie as you can do. Right. Okay. Absolutely. Okay, so let's go one more time on that. And I want you to sharpen up your spot too. And here's what I like to do with that. I'm gonna I take a student in the class and put them right here and have them hold up fingers. And you have to see if you can say to me what the fingers are as you're turning. And that's as you're doing those feet and thinking about what you're doing. Okay? Five, six, ready, go. Five, six, ready, go. Toe down 
keep showing the balls of your feet, but there's just something else to take out to separate the combinations. So pick up, pick up, pick up. Okay, so switch over and turn in. Five, six, seven, eight, and one. Thank you. 